just as we were coming in here, the first news came in that one of the world's most popular players, one of the most dignified players around the world, you went, he went into bat and everyone wanted him to score runs. Hashim Amla has retired. This is, uh, so, in, so in recent times, I mean, Brendan McCullum had uh, had already had already retired. Now Hashim Amla. Dale Stain. Dale Stain. Dale Stain only from Test cricket. The Hashim Amla is saying they're saying uh, the first news coming says all international cricket. And uh, that's a huge loss. Uh, uh, you knew that uh, uh, he was, the time was getting, coming, right? getting, yeah. getting closer to uh, just uh, all good things come to an end. Shadows were getting longer. You know that sun is setting yeah. on somebody's career. Uh, but you also knew that uh, it's, there was some gas left in the tank. He was still playing the World Cup. And even though the World Cup was not that uh, uh, as astonishing, but he did get runs in the pre in the warm-up games. He got a few 50s as well towards the latter half of the World Cup. So you knew that if he wanted to carry on, he could have carried on. Uh, so he's actually left the stage at a stage when uh, uh, people are asking why and uh, uh, But you're right. Not why he's now. right. The shadows were lengthening. You could make out that Hashim Amla was coming to the end, isn't it? Also, the the way he plays his game as well, you know, he he had those quick hands and yeah, and, and yeah. with uh, with time, you know, they they do get slower and the reflexes do get uh, yeah. get slower, Sometimes. which was which was seen with yeah. Hashim as well. And uh, but but when you look at his career, you know, he's, he's had a fantastic career, you know, in terms of the consistency which he's achieved and uh, made that impact not only in 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 Test matches but also in in ODIs and T20 as uh, as well, you know, he has he uh, he was never looked uh, never been looked at uh, a shorter format player. But when you look at those numbers, yes. you know they will Serious. surprise you very uh, pleasantly, and and uh, the consistency which uh, uh, which which he has got those runs with has been uh, phenomenal. I think it was a classic example of uh, Asian origin player learning to play on on quick tracks. Yeah. You know, so so he uh, he didn't move from his uh, as in the, uh, the, the Asian style of play, which is using a lot of wrists. And, and and that was a, a classic example of how uh, Asian origin player can adapt to uh, the the quick tracks of South Africa and uh, and and has a very distinct style of, uh, of, of of batting in those countries. You know, you know, I think he said he'll play domestic cricket. But both of you have been. Do, do you get a little indication inside you? Under ki awaz kehte hain. Kit, bit time time ho gaya. I remember the late David Hooks telling me once he was playing a shield game, and they bounced a couple at him. And as De Alan Border was passing by, he said, I think one hit his helmet. As he was passing by, Alan Border said, smell the coffee mate, the time's come. I just wonder if the Jofra Archer bouncer. That's what I was thinking of, yeah. about as well, that he's been hit on the head a couple of times. Uh, he also knows that uh, when you actually are uh, that big a player and you've done so well over a period of time, and keeping in mind that he batted at the top of the order in South African conditions. Uh, perhaps the toughest conditions to bat uh, across the globe where uh, everybody struggles generally. Uh, yes, even though you're growing up there, you're learning your craft there, but still the conditions are uh, uh, tough for everyone, in you included. Uh, there he got so many runs and when you set that bar too high, uh, then then you then you actually are competing with yourself. And uh, with him, you would expect that he'll be brutally honest. Yeah, I mean, the that there is nothing, there's no looking back, there's no coming back. Zach, last 10 years, if you look at the great South African Test players, You'd look at A.B. de Villiers, but you'd look at Dale Steyn and Hashim Amla. Maybe these were the three. They, I know there was Mone Mokkel, there was Faf Duplessis, there were others around in the support cast. Callis as well. Uh, yeah. Young. <laughs> Callis, yeah, he finished, <laughs> yes. what, three, four, year, four, five years ago, yes. I think... Uh, he has this way of just dropping that name like that, true. I, I, Callis was... Callis and Hashim, I think, you know, yeah. the, as far as test matches are concerned, because uh, Callis also uh, uh, someone yeah. who had a very strong uh, technique. Only that and, I didn't and, and you need that kind of technique to, to, yeah. to put up those kind of numbers, you know, and particularly in, 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 in those conditions which Akash was talking about, you know, it's, it's, not, uh, it's not easy condition for any batsman to, to adapt, you know, at, at, some, at any stage in the game, you always have some kind of help from the wicket and, and that makes it batting that much tougher. So, so, so that, that is a testimony to your concept concentration that is testimony to your uh, adapting and finding a way of 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 putting uh, uh, those hundreds on 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 board which hashim has been uh, doing consistently so i think yeah uh, with south african cricket, cricket i think you know these two names are are right up there uh, yeah. when, it, when it comes there's to there's one this. more player they need to find now i mean there's not a lot of players coming They're struggling through. already They're struggling already and uh, no ab no uh, hashim Yes, the younger crop is looking prom promising. Uh, there is Aidan Markram who looked alright. Van der yeah. looked alright. They're coming to India to play test matches. 
well it's a three test match series it's going to feel a lot longer uh, without hashim mamla i can tell you that much yeah i mean i remember what the game in delhi wasn't it hashim mamla and ab de villiers just batted on and on out. yeah yeah so till till that umesh yadav ball that dismissed yeah. i think ab de villiers down the leg side uh, they yeah. could have easily actually yeah. gotten away with the draw in that game yeah the one word you associate with hashim mamla apart from class is dignity that's that's a calm they said he never sweated you could just see he was just so calm you know you you got the feeling that the world was little pause gently salam he goes like yeah, that he, he's always in that zone yeah always very clear yeah. yeah you you could just Something look at him and, and know yeah. that you know he's just in his own world and uh, going about uh, doing his business uh, there you are so the news from south africa that uh, that the mighty hash hashim amla has said goodbye to international cricket